Over the weekend, we had some bad luck with our turkeys. When Dylan went to do the chores, um, he discovered one of our turkey hens dead on the nest. And we're not exactly sure what happened. Because um, the day before, she was doing fine. The only thing that we had noticed was that she had a ton of feathers pulled out. And so we were wondering if maybe the tom got her or maybe some predator got her or something. But, you know, the day before is when we noticed the feathers being pulled out. She had most of her tail feathers gone and, and things like that. So we really don't know if she was attacked or something. So now we're just down to one turkey hen. I certainly hope that the eggs that we have will survive and the, they'll go ahead and hatch out. Raising turkeys has proven to be a lot more difficult than we thought. See right there, she's off her nest again. See, look at all the feathers that were ripped out of the other hen. I'd really like to know what happened. See, there's the egg. Oh. Looks like that poopy one got pushed back there. This egg feels cold now, so I bet you it's not going to hatch. I'm just going to go ahead and take it and put it in the incubator. I should have just left it in there from the beginning. Hey, Miley, how are you? Good. What you been up to? Nothing. Nothing? Just coming out to help me do chores? Yeah. You're probably done, right? Almost. Getting there. Looks like you've been eating some strawberries. Mulberries. Mulberries, all mm. right. Yeah, Miley and Dylan went out the other day to the mulberry tree out in the pasture and picked a whole bunch of mulberries. And Miley's wanting me to make a pie with them, but we'll have to see. I'm interested in that. Maybe we can make a pie together, do you think? Yeah. Okay. Here, piggy, piggy, piggy. of mulberries out on the tree that's in the pasture and uh, Miley was wanting to try to make a mulberry pie. Well last night and maybe this morning some little mouse got in our house and ate a whole bunch of the mulberries so we don't have didn't have very many left or at least enough to make a pie. You know what kind of mouse that was that got in our house? No. <laughs> So anyway, last night we also picked some strawberries and uh, we had a bunch of them, but that same little mouse also got into the strawberries too. But anyway, um, I decided to mix the mulberries and strawberries together and make a strawberry and mulberry pie, but then there wasn't enough of either one of those to make one, so I'm, so we're going to add in a little bit of blueberries. So, so we're going to berry pie. Yep, it's just a... A little bit of this and a little bit of that berry pie is what we're making. So I guess we'll go ahead and get started. You can do the filling first if you like. So this. Yeah, why don't you put the fruit in first. Okay, and then next we're going to add 
third of a cup of flour. Why do you need flour? To thicken the juice up. Oh. And a cup of sugar. Nope, the mouse is in the berries again. <laughs> Good stuff. Yeah. Okay. Stir it all up. Okay. So I decided that since we fixed a pie that I needed to kind of fix a sort of fancy supper. At least it's fancy for us. Pinkies out. <laughs> I very rarely ever fix a pie, so um, when I do, I, I feel like I need to fix something to go along with it. Yeah. Tonight we're having pork chops, fried taters, and kale. The kale's from the garden, and the taters are some that I can from last year's garden and then we are also eating radishes too. Did you get them from the garden? Yep they are from the garden too. And then of course we have the pie that has those strawberries and mulberries that we picked. And blueberries even though we didn't pick those. Nope we didn't pick those. It's time yes. to cut that pie. Get all the way down to the bottom. Don't do that. <laughs> Why not? I don't know. There you go. Okay, dig one out of there. about half of that one. That'll be your piece. I get all the goodie out of it. Want me to want me dish up or you want to dish them up? I see that. You get the rest of the crust of yours? Oh. <laughs> I didn't notice that. <laughs> Thank you. Ah, that worked. <laughs> My so how is it? Uh, you don't want to eat any of it. I don't. No, you don't want to eat any. Save it for me. I'll I'll suffer through it for everybody. Okay. So it doesn't go to waste. 
So what do you think of it, Marley? It's good. 